Hello, so a client asked me how he would go about creating a paint bar study that paints the minute bar on a 10 second bar chart. So in other words, we have the, for example, the 942 bar painted, the 942, 10 seconds, 20 seconds, 30 seconds are not painted. And then the next one painted is the 943. We have that applied to a GBP USB, USD, sorry, and a meter chart, all both of them 10 second charts. So let's go and look at the program. It's very straightforward. The, uh, we can do it one of two ways. The first way is to say if time is not equal to time at the previous bar. Now you would say, well, hang on, the time was different between the 10 second bars. Well, actually in terms of the time keyword, it measures time in the hour, hour, minute, minute format. So that works perfectly well for our, for our requirements. Another way we could do it is using the date time class. So I'm just going to comment out here. I'm going to comment the, uh, the line that we were just talking about, and I'm going to uncomment here. And in this one, we're saying if bar date time dot second, that gets the second component of the, of the, uh, the time. And we need that to be equal to zero. Then if it's zero, then we plot it, plot paint bar on the chart. So I'm just going to verify that. Go back to the chart and you'll see exactly the same. We're getting the 10, the uh, 944, 945, it's a little bit difficult to see, and then the 946, and then similarly on the meter chart. Anyway, hopefully you'll find this useful. I've included the, uh, the code on the quick tip page. Thank you very much.